Some traps from Memphis. They really spent a lot of time with defensive pressure. Turn just over manhandled Olinson. Game. Meanwhile, the Tigers at 17 per game through two. Duren got it down low, and he's fouled. He'll shoot a couple of free throws. He is impressive, and when he's down low, he is a load to handle. Still ended up with a double-double, his first collegiate double-double. Shooting style, and he's shooting better than 75%. He's going to get to the line a lot of times. Of course, I jinxed him. But because he's... Memphis leads the all-time series over the Billikens 32-26 as Nesbitt misses both. Four team fouls now against Memphis, two against St. Louis. Okoro got it underneath, tried to jam it, and he gets fouled by Duren. Or, or a bucket was going to ensue. Jalen Duren back in the game. There's the alley oh from Alex Lomax. And St. Louis now. Memphis is going to have to do a better job on the boards blocking out. But this is something they did very well. Alex Lomax with a nice lob. Yep, you guessed it. Jalen Durham with a finish. It too. Put it on the money. Now there's that veteran leadership of Alex Lomax. We're going to get an offensive foul called on the screen by Duran. St. Louis' is zone in the first half. Largest lead for Memphis, 17. Nesbitt got it blocked by Duran. Here comes Memphis. They have the numbers. Bates leaves it for Duran, and he's fouled from behind by Okoro, who said it was all ball, Mr. Official. Coming right at you. Nice pass by. Got him with some of the body. Mentioned Jimerson played at Mount Verde Academy, as did Jalen Duran. Gave Memphis a big lift, not only offensively, but again, defensively. Fred Thatch Jr. back in the game for. Not allowing Memphis just to go on an unharnessed run. Durham again, right there, his presence felt. We've got a guy like Jalen Durham corralling. That Nolly gets beat back door and. Look at the three point shooting, and Memphis has hit seven of 12. Durham, another big block. Collins thought it was goaltending. Watch up trying to catch up too quickly. Got to make good shots each time. Lentz an offensive rebound and the putback in the NBA. Jones in the game. Hargrove tried to slam it. No. Jones gets the loose ball. Rainbow extension passes. Give the defenders a lot of time to get in. Duran may have gotten his hand on that one, and then a foul is committed by Memphis. Very impressed. Tough, tough guy. Harris. Oh, the putback by Jalen Duran. Nobody boxed out. For some sort of big time three like Tyler Harris. And then the dunk by Duran off the miss. He will come away with his third rebound. Jalen Duran against Okoro. Bucket and the bang. And that was just a lazy foul by Okoro. Who was such a great knack for where the ball is going to go. That's, that's a key component for a rebounder. Collins in traffic. Oh, great feed. And a nice job shielding himself from Duran was Martin Linson. Linson's had a good second half. Tigers with a turnover. Played three games, just 12 minutes in total for Memphis last season before transferring to St. Louis, where he hails from. Out rebounds their opponents by nice 21. Duran. He'll go to the free throw line to shoot two. Again tonight, it's 39-38 Memphis. That's a good job by Bates at 6'9, finding Duran at 6'11 with a height advantage. And Bates three, Quinones three, Minot three for Memphis. Duran now in double figures with. Redirected one of them right at the rim. Duren goes one of two. Free throw's basically a push in this game. Nolly. Nice move. That'll be a foul again. Collins with that last assist was his seventh of the game. Nice move by Nolly. And again, take your pick. Looking for a win number 66 in his fourth season with Memphis. Got into some situations where they, they struggled a bit scoring. Memphis defense had a lot to do with that. And their good kick out. And Duren kept it alive to Williams. He's 9 of 21, but he's been extremely effective. Nolly, no. Big rebound by Duren. The contact, and he nearly was able to bank it home. He'll go back to the free throw line in North Carolina Central. What you like about Duran is he's not a guy that complains, lets the game come to him. Duran is now up to six blocks. They've all come in the second half to go along with 12 points to Memphis on Friday. Hilltoppers coached by Rick Stansbury, the longtime Mississippi State coach. Over, but it should be 24, although they have not marked it down yet as 24. That was a shot clock violation. And they do. Unfortunately, credit Memphis with turnover number 24.